the whole film revolves around this magical mailbox. Mm -hmm. Now I was just wondering because you know how does it work? <laughs> well, if we knew mm, that, make mail. <laughs> <laughs> It'd be great. Yeah. Um, it, that, it's a, it's a, <laughs> it's a fantasy. So. I mean, it's, 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 it's more so a metaphor for, I think, what we lose as adults, um, which is the ability to let go and believe in things. As a child, you have no problem believing in, in the wanting to believe. The magic mailbox? Yeah, in the magic mailbox. But, I mean, so it's, it's us that make it work. Yeah, exactly. It's the relationship of these two people. I mean, the, we could have chosen not to let the game continue. That's right. You know, uh, but, but there's something in these two adults that need whatever it's offering to happen. And so they, they I think you're right. Yeah. Whatever he said. I would just wait. Would you? I would wait and wait and wait. I mean, I don't know. You'd think it would be impossible to wait, but you, you meet families who, because of unfortunate situations like war, are waiting and waiting and waiting and can wait and want to wait. So I don't, I, I think if you have something worth waiting for, it's, it's not the amount of time, but how you manage to keep connecting during that time, you mm. know? I mean, I think if there was no talking and no connecting, I think it would be... Then really yes. hard. Yeah, that's. I think much. it's impossible. But if you're able to connect and communicate in a way, you know, I think I'd say two years is a fair yeah, okay, amount. Two yeah, years. Okay, okay. Anymore. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Two years and two months uh, can't do it. Can't it. do it. When you use the magic to to have um, success or achieve, you know, with gambling or getting the right horse. You know, it never, never presidential works. elections doesn't work. Oh, well, they have to fix those. Yeah. So it doesn't. You know, it just. It just doesn't work. Yeah. But with love. It always works. <laughs> she she had her own role. She was not there to sort of. There's a dog that kind of cro that we both have in the film. That yeah. Kind of crosses time, I guess. And she was freakishly neat. I mean, she just had her own agenda. She was not your fluffy, cute little dog. No. So kind of aloof, had her own sort of thing going. Very professional. She's more <laughs> professional than we were. That's kind of hard sure. to get her out of the trailer. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> bit of a diva, then. A little bit, but has earned it. She's like the Meryl Streep of dogs. Yeah. In the yeah. business, right? I was respect. nervous the first scene with the dog. Were you? Yeah. Well, I heard well, she so comes much with such of, oh, my God. pedigree. I know. <laughs> and oh, scene. Yeah. <laughs> 